and we're back. More Batman. Manning. I'm going to find some more trivia questions for you. All right, while you're doing that. Maybe ones that don't suck. Yeah. That you like to get wrong. Harder questions that not everybody just knows. Who is Batman's uncle's brother's mother's sister? Uh, the Joker, obviously. <laughs> so they are related in a deeper sense. <laughs> Have you seen? There's a story arc that's actually yes. interesting that I haven't seen. Where his parents? Yes. Yeah, that's one I want to read. It's really, really cool. My friend was telling me about it. I was like, that just seems Insane. deep. Yeah. Like very deep. Well, if, well, for people who don't know what we're talking about. Um, so there's a story in an alternate universe where instead of Bruce's parents being killed, um, he was killed. So Bruce died, the boy. And Thomas Wayne. And Thomas Wayne becomes Batman. Dons the suit. And but. Avengers. No. Did you not, so you not know the crazy part? No. So the cra- the different part. Does he become the bad guy? Hold on. I'm telling I you. I want to guess, damn it. No. So the other part is Thomas Wayne becomes Batman. So his dad becomes Batman. Okay. His mom is so beat up about the whole thing, she becomes the Joker. Oh, cool. Yeah, so that's the cool part of that storyline. So that that story exists out there, and I really need to read it. Cause actually, I'll probably read that on the plane to E3. You know what you really should read? What's that? Oh, if you're bringing that on E3, you doing a digital? I'll probably do it digitally. Unless I can find a physical copy before I go. Four Color Fantasy, man. I, I, I need to go in there. Free anyway. plug, you guys. Yeah, Four Color. Actually, they've, they've done our stuff before. They promoted us. Um, you should, did you ever read the Death Claw stuff? No. Love it. You'd actually like it. Because you like Wolverine, don't you? Yeah, I like Wolverine. It's a mix mash of Marvel um, heroes and villains uh-huh. crossed with DC villains and heroes. Is so, to do that? So Dark Claw is Batman and Wolverine. Oh. And the the hyena is Joker and Sabretooth. Dude, it's awesome. Interesting. It's awesome. I don't know. It's one of the cooler, like, crossover comic books. Udon Comics did it. That sounds really weird to me. It's really cool. Um, there's even, like, fan-made figures. I love this Bane. I was. Well, I'm skipping through the conversation here. Uh, but I love Bane's voice. It's so awesome. Okay. Fred Tedeschiore. Talk to Bane. Oh, that's right. i got to get the Titan container for him. So. All right. Question. I don't know how good these questions are because they don't give me visual representation. Um, which of the following Batman villains once worked as a zoologist? Okay. The Riddler, Man Bat, Poison Ivy, or Killer Croc? I believe it's Man Bat. All right. We'll start there because it's not going to give me... I won't know until I hit the next button on this one. Oh, okay. And all the questions are here together. The door. Uh, sorry, all these guys have guns. You going on with Freeze and stuff? Yeah. Because I started the Bane thing, but Bane wants me to go beat up Titan. Uh, yeah, you just find those playing the game anyway. Yeah. There's, there's what, six or something? Five. Five? Because mm-hmm. you get one just for doing Two Faces line. Um, you get if, if I would go back to where I just was with the Joker, I'd get one. Uh, you get, you get one. Labs or whatever. Yeah, and then you get Battle one factor. right next to Solomon Grundy. All right, question number two: Which of the following actors never played a Batman villain? Okay, it's pretty easy. Okay, you got Jim Carrey, okay. Uma Thurman, Jack Nicholson, or Robin Williams. Robin Williams. I just go ahead and click Robin Williams. Robin Williams. <laughs> Like and sadly, he will never get to play a Batman. Yeah, not not, uh, not anytime soon, apparently. So, because I think he could have been a really good Calendar Man or something, like something a, awful like an oddball that. kind of character, Captain just Boomerang. completely out of his damn mind. The next one's a dead giveaway too. Okay. Which Batman movie does Robin get introduced? Batman Forever. Okay. Batman. Batman Returns. Or Batman and Robin. So you say it's a dead giveaway. But he was in Batman Forever. But which one came first? Batman Forever came first. But did it? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty All sure. Alright, I'll click it. But introduced, I don't think that was... Because wasn't he in... What were the other two choices? Batman and... Batman Forever, Batman and Robin, Batman, and Batman Returns. 
He might have been in the Batman. I can tell you he was not in Batman or Batman Returns because I've watched those movies. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, times. I was thinking of like older movies, like 66 Batman and stuff like that. No, 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 no. Batman, the 1989 movie, uh-huh. and Batman Returns, the 1992 yeah, that's movie. The Penguin with Danny DeVito. Right. Yeah. Penguin okay, and so Christopher yeah, no, Walken. Yeah. Batman and forever. Harvey Dent and all that fun jazz. Because uh, Batman and Robin introduced Batgirl. Yes. With Alfred's niece or something. Yeah, her niece that Batman falls in love with. Uh, I, was like, I was like, this is fucking terrible. What are you it's, doing to my... Dude, that whole, George Clooney is not Batman. What's, what are we talking about? I didn't start the timer. We're at five and a half, give or take. Okay. Uh, so then we got... Really? This Who made this test? I want to punch this person. Are they, are they more How easy questions? Bruce's parents die. They were shot on Crime Alley. Is that an option? What are my options? <laughs> what is this? What, everything's fucked up now? No, these questions don't make any sense. Because this isn't even the right name of the movie. Oh, fuck. Which right actress now. replaced Katie Holmes as Rachel Dawes in The Dark Knight? They have the Black Knight written, but... Oh! <laughs> the Black Knight with Martin Lawrence? <laughs> yeah. Um, you got Rachel McAdams, Emily Blunt, Maggie Gyllenhaal, or Kirsten Dunst. Maggie Gyllenhaal. There we go. No, now phone's ringing. Do, 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 do. I don't know the answer to the next question. What's that? All of Penguin's communications. Who are the three founding families of Gotham City? Okay, what are my options? Your first option is Wayne, Tyler, and Savage. Savage, Wayne, and Stevens. Or Stevens, Wayne, and Tyler. I wasn't expecting any of those answers. Read them again. Wayne, Tyler, and Savage. Okay. Savage, Wayne, and Stevens. Or Stevens, Wayne, and Tyler. So which ones do you know? I know the Wayne. Well, Wayne, obviously, but... Of the other three. Savage and Tyler no problem. and Stevens? Yeah. Uh, Savage sounds really familiar to me for some reason. What's that? Savage sounds really familiar to me. I was thinking, I was hoping that Falcones would be something in there. I don't know. Maronis, but no, apparently. Um... I don't know. Why well, did you pick one? I did the one with Savage. There's two with Savage. Savage and... Tyler? Or Stevens? Tyler. I say Tyler. Alright. Last question and we'll find out the results and see how stupid we all are. Who played the role of Catwoman in Batman Returns? Halle Berry, Michelle Pfeiffer, Julia Roberts, Drew Barrymore, or Penelope Cruz? Michelle Pfeiffer. Probably the only role that I actually love Michelle Pfeiffer in. It's been a long time since I've seen that movie. And we got more questions. Uh, more questions? <laughs> yeah. I forgot how this room works. Forgot what? How this room works. What are, how are we at? Eight minutes. Okay. Eight and a half minutes. Just want to make sure we don't go like... Because I don't know how long minutes. the we were in before we synced it. True. Okay, here we go. In the room. So if we go to like 12 minutes, we'll probably be okay. Okay. A little behind the scenes for everybody at home. <laughs> yeah. Eat it. Uh, who are the villains in Batman and Forever? Freeze and the Riddler, Two Face and the Riddler, Freeze and Catwoman, or Penguin and Freeze? And Batman Forever was the Riddler and Two Face. Riddler and Two Face? Yeah. I don't know. I don't think I ever saw that one. That's the one with Jim Carrey. Yeah, I don't think I ever saw that one. Really? Who's the Batman in that one? Is that the Val Kilmer one? Yeah. Yeah, I never saw that one. Okay. You didn't I see, I've seen like that tiny one, bits and pieces from clipping those, through on TV. Out of Batman Forever and Batman Robin, the abomination that they are, that one's the one that's worth seeing. <laughs> that's bad? Like really, really bad? No, that's the one that's worth like a watch. Of the two, you'd watch those? I would watch Forever. I would rather watch Val Kilmer as Batman the than... George, George Clooney, because Clooney. Clooney is a terrible Batman. And the Batmobile in that movie was just oh. atrocious. Oh, 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 oh. I keep hitting the wrong button. I'm going to get myself killed, that's what I'm going to do. Oh. 
Anyway. All right. What is Ivy's real name? Penguins keeping track of this. I'm gonna have to hear. Harley Quinn. Okay. <laughs> Laura Fox. <laughs> nah. Quinn Myers or Myers Harley. It's not any of those. Poison Ivy's real name? Yeah. It's like Pamela Isley. You're right. We're gonna skip that question. How did Freeze become a villain? He was abandoned by his parents, began a life of crime. Oh. He was kidnapped and cryogenically cryogenically frozen. Okay. He fell through ice and almost drowned, or he was the victim of an industrial accident. I don't know if the fell through ice thing's canon or not. <laughs> but I'm gonna go with that one. Which one? The ice? Yeah. I'm I think guessing wrong. they're basing this off the, the movies. movies. Yeah, because a lot of these are movies. Because if that's the case, then he was a victim of an industrial accident. Didn't he fall in the ice? Not in the movie. In the movie, he fell in the vat of the cryogen liquid. Oh, while yeah. While he was working on saving his wife. Yeah, I thought that was ice. No. He no, fell I, into the vat of like, seen cryogenic like, fluid. I've seen that movie like once because it's terrible. It's terrible. It's it terrible. really bad. Yeah, no, he was working on trying to save his wife. And That's in the process, he fell into a vat of, you got shot. I knew it was going to get me killed, too. I was like, why am I hiding here? What is the penguin's weapon of choice? Ice, a whip, acid-spewing flowers, or umbrellas? It's an umbrella. Although, if you were playing this game, you would say a cigar. But no, actually, the penguin was just on screen when you read yeah. the question. <laughs> I know. Which of the following villains was once a district attorney and ally of Batman before turning evil? Miss Behaven. <laughs> I've always hated that name. It's so dumb. Poison Ivy, Catwoman, or the Two-Face? What was it? Who was once a district attorney and ally of Batman? Uh, Two-Face. <laughs> you hear district attorney and you're like... Okay. Yeah. All right. We are nearing the end of this one. Well, do you want to... How many questions there are left? I don't know, because it's got another continue button. We'll ask these three questions real quick. And if there's more, we'll, we'll stop. If there's not, we'll the next it. one, yeah. yeah. What are Batman's superpowers? <laughs> Just say it. He doesn't have powers. There we go. Why did you get me? Why did you make me say that? <laughs> You're a dick. <laughs> God damn it. He's not a superhero. He doesn't have any superpowers. Shut up, yeah, buddy. superpowers. Who looked after Bruce Wayne after his parents died? His grandparents, his parents' best friends, nobody looked after him, his maid, or his butler. His butler. And last question. Oh, this isn't actually a question. That was the last question. We are male, and we're just going to put a bullshit birthday in. Uh, <laughs> the last two questions are, everybody comes from different walks of life. What sex are you? <laughs> And the last one's birthday. Oh, uh, we got to answer the poison ivy question. I'm going to put Quinn Myers. Sure. Because, you know, it's not right. I don't think it's Quinn Myers. I'm pretty sure it's like Pamela Isley. Oh, shit. They saw me. I don't have any results. What's, what? Damn it. What the frick, man? What did it say? What did it do? Post your results here. Thank you for taking the Batman quiz. <laughs> Thank you. Thank Your you score better. for taking this quiz is located above and is based on a scale of 0 to 100. But there's no score! Is it not? Did they lie to you? You got lied to. You. Share your results. What the hell? I'm going to try reloading it real quick, see if we get anything. Okay. Nothing. What a bunch of jerks. That was a waste of time. All right, let's end this episode, because I'm... Beat? <laughs> no, not beat, just annoyed with this. All right. Guns. Later. Bye.